What's up, this is GM, and before I start, I want to tell you about TubeBuddy. In case you don't know, TubeBuddy is a free website that will help you manage and grow your YouTube channel. Thanks to them, some of my videos even show up as top results. Want to give them a try? Check the description below for the link. What's up everyone, today's product is Donner's Disco Light. In the box we have the light itself, we have a charging cable which I already plugged in, and you do have to plug it into a wall, it is a two-prong. Then we have a mount, and it comes with all the things you need for that, a remote, and we have a manual, very short manual in English. So, I'm gonna go ahead and turn off my light that I have right up here. So it might be a little dark to see for now, but don't worry, the reason is because I'm going to be showing you all the functions that you can do with this remote. So, real quick, on the front you might notice that this is infrared, so that means you need to be pointing the remote towards the disco light in order for it to be turned on and off with the remote. And also, real quick, on the back, we have where you would plug in for charging, or sorry, not for charging, just for use. And then you have a switch right here for off auto music, motor controller, and then a mic. And I'll go over all that in a bit. On the back, we, or sorry, on the bottom, we have a little vent for the cooling fan. So I think what I'll go ahead and do is, is I'll point this in this direction. I'll aim my camera a little bit higher up so you can see the lighting effect that it'll do. Keep in mind my room isn't the darkest, so um, some of these lights are, it's, a, it's very bright, first of all. It can cover almost an entire room. Um, as far as I could tell, it could cover an entire living room, at least for my house. So do keep that in mind. So I'm gonna go ahead and flip it to auto right there. And you know what, I'll place that at an angle so you can see a little bit better. So as you can see right now, it is doing a lighting effect. Let me go and press that real quick. All right, so it is doing a lighting effect and it has a mic on the back. So if you were to put this to the music mode, if you're playing music, you would wanna probably keep your, whatever's playing the audio somewhere near the lighting source so that way it can pick up on the beat and change with the beat. I'll go ahead and place it on that and just give you an example. For, uh, if I was to tap on it, you could see it's like changing the pattern every time I tap. And you don't have to tap on it, it was just easier to do that since I'm not playing actual music, but if I was to play, do it on the table even, you can see it changes sometimes. So that's a really neat little feature, so if you were to use this at a party or something, that'd be a really cool little feature to have. And let me go ahead and change this back to the normal auto mode. So, now for the remote. I'm gonna go over most of the buttons on here, so we have the motor stop. So as you can see, it stopped rotating. And that's if you just kind of want to keep it in a static way for more of a decoration piece. But I press it again to turn it back on. Then the next button is a strobing, as you can see there. That was the rightmost button. I'll press it again. Oh, I guess pressing again does not stop it. Let me go ahead and press auto one. And let me turn the motor back on. So auto one. Auto 2, so this is again different types of lighting modes. Auto 3, some of these are look kind of festive as well, so you know you could use these for any type of holidays as well. That was for sound 1, sound 2, sound 3. Then we have laser RG, so that means it's going to be all only the laser which is at the bottom, and it will do a red green pattern. Laser red, and then laser green. Then we have LED auto, and as you can see, it's just doing various patterns over and over again. And it is going to switch between the three main colors, red, green, and blue. Then we have just red, just green, just blue. And keep in mind, I am doing this during a pretty day lit time. There's a lot of light actually coming in my room. So the fact that you can see this when I'm next to a window is pretty impressive. Now we have a red, blue, red, green, green, blue, and then red, green, blue. So you can see it has all three. And then at the bottom, you have four different buttons there you can press as well. So you can see it's changing the pattern each time it strobes. And then that one is, and there we go. So that's pretty much all of the buttons on here that you can mess around with. Of course, most of these will work with music as well. So let me go ahead and change this to music mode. 
Alright, so I flipped it to the music mode, and if you remember, I told you there's three buttons right here that says sound one, sound two, sound three. So these are the three different modes it can do with music. So right now, I have it on sound one. Right now, it looks like nothing's happening, but if I was to play music near this, what will happen is, is you can see, even with my voice, you can kind of pick it up, is it will show some light. So what I'll do is I'll tap on the table, and that will mimic kind of the bass of a sound or the drum of a sound. So as you can see, every time I'm tapping, it just pretty much flicks the light. So if you were to play a song that has a lot of music, and if it was, you might want to keep it closer to the disco ball, you could have it pretty much flashing with the beat. As for sound two, this is what we have. Every time I tap, it changes the pattern. Sound three. So as you can see, it has a lot of uniqueness for each one. I'm gonna go ahead and switch this back to auto. Overall, I would say that this is perfect for any real use that you need it for. Parties, for get-togethers, even for outdoor. Um, I'm not sure about the waterproof rating. I'm assuming it doesn't have one. So I would be careful with using outdoors, but you could do it through your window or something if you wanted. However, the fact that it is so small, it can, you know, it's very, very small as you can see, means that you can take it with you wherever you want. And that's perfect if you're going to someone else's place for a party and they need it. It's not cumbersome at all, so it's easy to take around with you. That is a very nice little feature to have, especially since it's only a charging cable, this, and a remote. You know, that's not much to have to carry around. Different patterns are also perfect for holidays, um, especially if you're getting these for holidays. As you can see, it has a lot of patterns, which are really, really nice for any type of holiday. And the fact that it's not pretty much singular to a single holiday, that's nice. So, you know, it's not showing a bunch of Christmas trees and stuff, so, but it has a red-green option. So, see, so the fact that it has a red-green option means that you could use it for Christmas time because it's the Christmas theme. Um, but since it doesn't have the pattern, you could also use this for other occasions that aren't Christmas. So that's a nice little thing, so you have a lot of variety with this. That's it for this video. I hope you found it helpful. I'd love it if you could leave a thumbs up and subscribe. If you have any questions, leave a comment below as well. Thanks for watching, and the link for this will be in the description below, so make sure you check that out.